Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to restore your phone from a bricked state. Now in order to follow along, make sure you watch this video completely once and then follow along step by step. This tutorial will work for OnePlus 7, 7 Pro, 70 and the 70 Pro. Now let's get started. Now go to the link in the description and it will take you to an XDA page. Under downloads, select any of the link which will take you to the fastboot firmware download page. From there, make sure you select Europe if you are from Europe and global if you are from anywhere else in the world. Also note, download the file that starts with 10 if your phone is running in Android 10 and go with the latest version starting with 9 if your phone is running in Android 9. Now after you download, make sure you extract the zip file into a separate folder and keep it somewhere accessible because you'll need it throughout this process. After that, go to your mobile phone. and power it off. Wait for your mobile phone to completely power off. Once that's done, you're now supposed to go into fast boot mode. You can do that by pressing and holding on your volume up and down button along with your lock button and holding it until you get a vibration. Once you feel the vibration, let go of all three and this will take you into fast boot mode. Now once you're into fast boot mode, connect your mobile phone with your Windows PC and open a command prompt window. After opening a command prompt window, Make sure you also open the separate folder which you have created that contains the extracted files from the firmware. Now from the folder drag and drop the fastboot.exe file into the command prompt and type devices and hit enter. Now if you see a random string of numbers and letters followed by fastboot that means your windows pc has now detected your mobile phone if your mobile phone was not detected and if it says it would say unauthorized now if you get the message unauthorized make sure you download oem drivers from the description below and install it on your windows system and try again now if you have done all the steps correctly so far you can proceed by closing the command prompt window and locate the file named flash space all dot b80 once you find the file double click on it after double clicking on it let it do its job this will take around 15 minutes so please be patient bear in mind you will see warnings like invalid parts file and so on this is not an error please ignore it I will show you the entire process so that you can compare with the system
now once this is done your phone will now boot back into stock rom this will take slightly more time than usual because technically this is the first time your phone is booting back into stock rom please give it its time you can now close the command prompt window and disconnect your windows pc from the phone i will fast forward the booting process Once the phone boots back on, you can now proceed by rooting your phone and installing TWRP on it. If you need to restore warranty, you need to lock your bootloader. In order to do that, make sure you watch the other video from my channel. You can find the link in the description or from the card above. That's it. Thank you for watching. If you have any doubts or queries, make sure you comment them down below. You can also reach out to me on Twitter and I'll make sure I'll answer all your questions as soon as possible. Please support this channel by showing whether you liked or not by hitting the like or dislike button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for more OnePlus related videos. Once again, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.